On October the 15th, 2021, David Crosby releases a 50th anniversary edition of his 1971 solo album, If Only I Could Remember My Name. It will contain a remastered version of the original album and a second disc featuring unreleased demos, outtakes and alternate takes from the album's original sessions. Looking for ways to deal with the death of his girlfriend, Christine Hinton, David retreated to the ocean and his boat, the Mayan. In between those voyages, Crosby recorded this album. The album's credits read like a who's who of early 70s rock stars. Jerry Garcia, Joni Mitchell, Grace Slick, Phil Lesh, Mickey Hart, Bill Krautsman, Yorma Kakonan, Paul Kantner, Greg Rowley and Jack Cassidy, along with Graham Nash and Neil Young. But David says it was Jerry Garcia who helped him through the sessions. There'd be that grin and then that look in the eyes and this fascination with the music. Easy, not forced. Graceful, fun, ever-present. It was a kindness. I'm pretty sure. Jerry never said that or even implied it. It was just, I heard you were doing something. What are you doing? Let's do something. I must have looked at the cover of this album a thousand times, if not more. Is the sun rising or is it setting? Is the expression in Crosby's eyes, sadness, trepidation, hope, regret, introspection, looking backwards to the end of an era or forward to a new beginning. The album is far and away David Crosby's best solo effort in my opinion. It's great from top to bottom. Highlights include the venomous What Are Their Names, the beautiful laughing and traction in the rain. But it's the last three tracks, Song With No Name, Orleans, I Swear There Was Somebody There all adorned with wordless vocals, where Crosby, with the help of Johnny Mitchell, layers harmony on harmony on harmony on harmony to hauntingly beautiful effect. This album has been part of the soundtrack of my life for so many years. I've loved it from the moment I first heard it back in the day. And it will be fascinating to hear these songs being worked out in the studio, the demos, the sketches, and how it all came together. Yes, I'm really looking forward to this one. I'd love to hear your comments on this album. If you know this album, I'd love to read your comments. Please put them in the comment section below. Please give us a like, please subscribe to the channel, but most of all, stay safe, stay well, and I'll see you in the next video.